and welcome to another installment of Chocolate Chat. I am Chocolate Yoda, spelled Y-O-D-D-A-H, because film studios are litigious. Uh, and today I'd like to share what I think is an interesting experience. I was coming out of a store with uh, three bags of lemons, which is, I guess, kind of unusual to just have that, right? And a woman in a parking lot uh, just asked, you know, what are you going to do with the bag of lemons? And I told her it was for a juice fast that I was doing. And then we wound up having like a 10 minute conversation uh, about being vegetarians and about, um, you know, this particular fast and other types of fasts and whatever it was, you know. And it, even though it's kind of an innocuous experience, what I enjoyed about it was that it reminded me about uh, three-year-olds and how they interact with each other. You know, I, I believe that at, at three years old, you know, you're old enough to communicate, but not quite old enough where the world has beaten all your joy out of you, right? And I think that that's our uh, most pure form as humans. And, you know, when, when a three-year-old walks up to another three-year-old, they don't ask, what's your political affiliation? How much money do you work? What's your religion? You know, they don't, they don't do any of that. You know, where are you from? They just say, do you want to play? Or my name is so-and-so. What's your name? Something like that, right? It's, it's just very straightforward in the moment without any agenda beyond connecting with another person. Um, and this happened to be a Caucasian woman, uh, older than me. And, you know, I look like, 90% of the composite sketches out there. So it's, it's not common for a white lady to, to walk up to me and just start having a conversation. You know, it was daytime and it was a safe place and all that other stuff, but still that's not a common occurrence. And I, I really enjoyed the fact that, you know, we could just be two people talking, never found out her name. She never asked me mine. It wasn't necessary. Um, you know, it was just, hey, I see that you have three bags of lemons. That seems interesting to me, so I'm going to ask about it. And I was like, oh, she's asking me about my lemons, so I'll tell her about it. You know, so in essence, we were like three-year-olds uh, with no agenda, just connecting uh, to each other, and then went away. Chances are I'll never see her again in my life. But I really believe that that's how we're wired, just to interact with other people that way. Like, none, none of us talked about anything, politics or religion or, you know, nationality or anything like that, you know, status in the world, you know, how much money do you make? None, none of that stuff. It was just, she noticed something, she asked about it, and we got into a conversation. And, you know, I would encourage other people. You know, if you see lemons, ask about lemons, <laughs> but really just be in the moment and, and converse with people. And, you know, she, she was an interesting person. She had been a, a vegetarian for 50 years and I'm 34 years in the game. And, you know, it, it, she looked fantastic. I, I, I would have assumed that she was younger than me, but she's actually seven years older than me. Um, and, you know, that was very encouraging and all that, but it was just a lovely moment. Uh, two human beings connecting, and I think that's just spectacular. So that's it for now. Uh, I hope you're having a wonderful day, and if not, let's get it wonderful. Talk to you soon. Peace. Peace. <laughs>